Hey everyone, I already showed you how you can quickly log out of your Twitter account and now let's take a look at some different Twitter thing that we're gonna start out really quickly. So in order to copy the link of someone on the Twitter account on your iPhone, make sure to open up Twitter and open up pretty much any of the accounts. Like for example, I'm gonna go here, here's Tim Cook. I'm gonna open up this page and here at the top of it, like you have the description and all the tweets, but here are the three dots. You don't really have like a sharing option for a profile, but you can share right away the Tim Cook, like share Tim Cook via three dots. So I'm gonna tap on this. And now I have multiple options in here, but one of them is copy link to profile. I'm gonna tap on that and the link has been copied to clipboard. So right now if I go to Safari and I paste the link right here, it's gonna open up my page here in a Safari. So yeah, it's gonna be his account, his profile picture and all the stuff, but not using the app, the Twitter app, but actually using the Safari version. So this is exactly how we can share it. And as you can notice, there are some other things besides just copying the tweet. You can also just share it with AirDrop or send it like using some apps, some social media, whatever. So there are plenty of options. Now, when it comes to your personal account, it's pretty much the same thing. Just go to your homepage, now tap on your profile picture and profile. This is the Foxtech Twitter account, so you can follow me here if you want to. And when it comes to your personal profile on the Twitter, you don't really have any share button or any three dots in here. But the way that it works is that you can, for example, just click here and you can share any of your tweets. So you can copy a link, but this is gonna be just to copy of this exact tweet. So let me show you what that looks like. So, so I'm gonna go to notes and create a new one and I'll paste this link right here. And you can see that I've added the twitter.foxtag and the status and some information about it. So the thing is that if I delete the, the link until I get to just my username, so you can see that I'm gonna delete every single thing except for the twitter.com slash foxtag. So this is what I end up with. And now I have a link to my account. So, and as you can see, it's the same link. So twitter.com slash foxtag and twitter.com slash foxtag. So this is exactly how it works. And you can just delete the rest of the tweet, uh, the tweet link and you end up with your profile link. Anyways, hope this video helped you out. If you want to know how you can download videos from the Twitter using your iPhone, then check out this one right here. And here you're going to find out all the things that you need to know about it.